Before we begin, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to help the channel grow and keep up to date with our latest videos. Hi and welcome to another video by me, Flojo. Today we're looking at the Power Automate Desktop Actions and we're looking at the Remove Duplicate Items from a List action. So what is the Remove Duplicate Items from a List action? It's an action that finds duplicate items in a single list and deletes the duplicate entries. Okay, so this can also be done with case sensitive items. If we have a capital F flow Joe and then just a lowercase f flow Joe in a list, we can actually make sure that we remove any duplicates that contain any case sensitivity or we can turn that off and ignore that. So before we get started, let's look at other actions that we're gonna be using in this demonstration, just so that you have an idea of what's going on. If you haven't ever seen the create list action, I have a video about creating lists and adding items to a list on my YouTube channel. I suggest you looking at that for more in-depth information, but essentially we're creating a placeholder variable for a list that we're essentially going to be adding items to. And then we're going to use the add item to list action to add the items to that list. Okay, so what does it look like? Well, this is what the remove duplicate items from a list action looks like when you first add it. Now, you're going to want to select the list um, from the remove duplicate items section that you're going to want to remove the duplicates from. And when you're doing this, if you look at the little red square on there, it's surrounding the squiggly curly brackets with the X. If you click on that, you can select the list you want rather than having to type the percent sign and list name and close it out with a percent sign. Now what you can also do, and what we were talking about momentarily ago, uh, was the, do you want to ignore the case items? Well, you, this little toggle down here allows you to switch between ignoring text case and um, actually using it. So that's what it looks like. Let's take a look at it in action on Power Automate Desktop. Okay, so we're on Power Automate Desktop. I've already created one of our flows and what I'm going to do is I'm going to firstly create a list because we need a list to be able to remove duplicates from. So let's create example list. So now we've created a list called example list. It currently has nothing in it. And you can see over the flow variables over the right hand side, there is absolutely nothing. So then we're going to use the action add item to list. And as I said previously, um, I have a video that goes into in depth on how to create and add items to list. So check that out if you need to. But what we're going to do is we're going to add names to this. So let's add Joe. And then let's select here this uh, select variable section and then just select the list so we don't have to type all of this out and press save okay so we've got joe added now let's copy and paste that so we're adding two joes let's add another one and let's change that to jacks save and then let's add another um and we'll add uh flow joe this time Okay, and then let's add another. So we'll add Meg. And what we'll do is we'll add a duplicate Meg as well. So what we're doing at this moment in time, we're creating a list called example list. We've got an item of Joe being added, another one called Joe, then another of Flow Joe, then another of Meg, and again, Meg again. And then we're adding jacks. So we've got two duplicates. We've got Joe twice and we've got Meg twice. So what we're looking to do is remove the duplicates. So let's use the remove duplicate items from list. And then what we simply do is we select the list that we want to check for duplicates in. Now, if you want to ignore um, the text casing. So for example, if I had a small j on one of the joes i can uh, check this to make sure that we're removing any that have um, the same characters but not necessarily the same case type but in this instance i'm just going to press save now what i'm going to do is i'm going to run through 
But what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a breakpoint here. So we stop after the create of a list and we'll check the list out. And then we'll see what happens after we run it through the remove duplicate items. So I'm just going to hit run now. And then let's check out our list. So at the moment we have Joe, Joe, Floyd Joe, Meg and Meg. So if I do run next action, we should then have Joe, Joe, Floyd Joe, Meg, Meg and Jax. So we've got two duplicates. We've got Joe and Meg duplicated. So now let's run it through this particular action, the remove duplicate items from list. And then now because we are um, using this, we're basically overwriting the example list. So you can see in the flow variables on the right hand side, we've still got our example list there. But now when I open it, one of the Joes have gone, one of the Meg's gone, and we are left with essentially Joe, Flo Joe, Meg and Jax. The additional Meg and the additional Joe has been removed and it doesn't create a new variable. What it does is it simply overwrites the list that you're passing through to give you a managed and removed duplicate items from that particular list. And that is how you remove duplicated items from a list on Power Automate Desktop. Thanks for watching another video by me, Flo Joe. If you like the video, don't forget to hit that like button or select a video on your screen right now to continue learning more about the Power Platform.